Hello everyone, welcome to Route to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting equation. So, the given question is find the solution of A that satisfies the given equation root 1 plus root 1 plus A equals to root cube under A. So, here we have given an equation and we are asked to find the solution of this variable. So, without any delay, let's start the solution. So, we have given root under 1 plus root under 1 plus a equals to root cube under a. So, in the next step, in order to eliminate this root, we will square both the side of equation. So, by squaring both the side of equation, we have 1 plus root under 1 plus a equals to root cube under a square. So, this implies is 1 plus root under 1 plus a equals to this root cube under a can be written as a to the power 1 by 3 whole square. So, we know an exponential rule that is a to the power m whole to the power n is equals to a to the power mn. So, by applying this exponential rule, we can write 1 plus root under 1 plus a equals to a to the power 2 by 3. So, in the next step, let's just take this one to the right hand side. So, we have root under 1 plus a equals to a to the power 2 by 3 minus 1. Again, in order to eliminate this square root, we need to square both the side of equation. So, we have 1 plus a equals to a to the power 2 by 3 minus 1 whole square. So, this implies is 1 plus a equals to, let us apply the a minus b whole square algebraic identity here. So, we have a to the power 3 whole square plus 1 minus 2 multiplied with a to the power 2 by 3 multiplied with 1. So, here we have plus 1 plus 1 get cancelled out. So, we have a equals to a to the power 4 by 3 minus 2 a to the power 2 by 3. Now, taking a to the right hand side, we can write a to the power 4 by 3 minus 2 multiplied with a to the power 2 by 3 minus a equals to 0. This implies this. Now, let's just take a to the power 2 by 3 common. So, we can write a to the power 2 by 3 multiplied with a to the power 2 by 3 minus 2 minus. So, here we have taken a to the power 2 by 3 common. So, here we have a to the power 1. We will do 1 minus 2 by 3 which is equals to a to the power 1 by 3. So, we will write a to the power 1 by 3 here equals to 0. So, this implies is a to the power 2 by 3 multiplied with we can write this a to the power 2 by 3 as a to the power 1 by 3 whole square minus a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 equals to 0. Let us assume this equation as a quadratic equation with a variable a to the power 1 by 3. So, by using middle term splitting method, we can easily factorize it. So, let us factorize it. So, we can write a to the power 1 by 3 square minus 2 multiplied with a to the power 1 by 3 plus a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 equals to 0. So, this implies is a to the power 2 by 3 multiplied with let us just take a to the power 1 by 3 common from this two term. So, we have a to the power 1 by 3 multiplied with a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 plus let us just take 1 common. So, we have a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 equals to 0. So, this implies is we can write a to the power 2 by 3 multiplied with a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 multiplied with a to the power 1 by 3 plus 1 equals to 0. So, from here we have 3 solution for the variable a. So, we can write a to the power 2 by 3 equals to 0 and another solution is a to the power 1 by 3 minus 2 equals to 0 and a to the power 1 by 3 plus 1 
equals to zero so from here we can directly write a equals to zero is one of the solution of a and from here we have a to the power one by three equals to two this implies is by cubing both side of equation we have a equals to eight is the second solution of a and similarly this implies is we have a to the power one by three equals to minus one by cubing both the side we have a equals to minus one so from here we have a equals to zero or eight or minus one so what i asked to find we are asked to find which solution of a satisfies the given equation if i put e solution if i put each of this value then only a equals to 8 satisfies the given equation hence the solution of a is equals to 8 is our answer i hope you have understood the solution thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting videos thank you